The fifth annual Devit Arts Festival, the biggest in the region, recently brought 40,000 art lovers to this industrial park turned art space called Chiglana on the outskirts of Belgrade. A significant change from an arts and culture were on the back burner in Serbia following years of war and the closure of two major state museums. Yes, it was a difficult time. It's still some kind of difficult, but it's uh, more open now. The, the, the artist can, 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 can show himself more and present himself more because uh, people are hungry for the art. Uh. Victor Kiss is putting the finishing touches on his Nikola Tesla sculpture. Ironic, as Kiss himself similarly never felt like he fitted in in traditional art circles. So he created his own space for independent artists like himself. What's old is new again. This abandoned brick factory has been given new life as the center for Belgrade's thriving independent art scene. Just a few kilometers from the city center, Tiglana has become a haven for artists and non-artists alike. Even professionals from other fields with a creative itch can come here to exhibit their work. Here you can find street art, sculptures, installations, and an indoor art gallery. The space is open to visitors until midnight daily and serves as an entry point into the art world for many Serbs. Ordinary people didn't have much uh, contact with the art. Uh, even in the galleries, I mean, they were afraid to go in the galleries because they didn't know what can they expect there. They didn't know what the art means because uh, Artists themselves put them in, put into position, uh, you know, something mysterious, something uh, specific. They put them in that position so hard that ordinary people couldn't reach him. Painter Jovana Visnic immediately fell in love with the space. I mean, it, it attached me on the first few, it with, with the energy and with the freedom and with the, with the feeling that you can uh, connect here with the others, with the artists, easily. She says Tiglana is an invaluable resource for artists like herself. But this is what, what Belgrade needed for a long time and uh, that's why I think it's so unique for, for us and for, for this area in general. Kiss could have gone anywhere else to ply his trade, but says Serbia has its own advantages. Material and transportation costs are lower than elsewhere in Europe and he has the freedom here to fly under the radar. When your country don't, doesn't, don't care much about art, really don't care, for long years because of war, because of you know, everything that happened here, we have more freedom than any, I have more freedom here than in any other country. For Kiss, Tiglana is his response to the classic art scene, where he can literally open the door for indie artists and future art lovers all at the same time. Adel Halim, TRT World, Belgrade.